the first image that I took is the AP projection of the colon and the AP demonstrates the entire colon and the next image that I took was the AP axial as shown here and the AP axial demonstrates the recto sigmoid area so it, is, it shows the, the sigmoid as shown in this image and then the next image I took was the LPO and that's shown right here it was an AP oblique projection in the LPO position and the LPO best demonstrates the right colic flexure and the RPO which is next best demonstrates the left colic flexure and the next image that I took was the right lateral D cube as shown right here and the right lateral D cube best demonstrates the medial side of the ascending colon and the lateral side of the descending colon then next I took the PA left lateral D cube and the left lateral D cube best demonstrates the lateral side of the ascending colon and the medial side of the descending colon and um, I also took a lateral projection of the rectum which is right here and the lateral projection of the rectum obviously um, demonstrates the uh, rectum and distal sigmoid and finally I then took my post evac film which is shown right here and um, it just shows the barium that's remaining along with the air in the large intestine and that sums up my barium enema trigger